Hi friends, very good morning. Welcome to Anu Academy. Very good morning friends. In today's class in our channel, we are going to discuss disaster management uh, subject and uh, we are going to discuss disaster management uh, important questions for the upcoming semester examination. So this disaster management is for BTEC third year, second semester. So let us start uh, today's class. If you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel. Please like and share our channel. Thank you very much. Now we will start uh, discussing this disaster management important questions. Okay. So first question, distinguish between environmental stress, hazard and disaster giving examples. Second question, you can see here, describe ecosystem approach to mitigate environmental stress in what way it is different from the perception approach so a and b second question a bit is there discuss uh, various types of natural disasters in india and highlight their effects explain the various stages of perception approach so this is a and b third question c a and b how is environmental hazard linked to ecology explain with respect to drought and B bit is drought and floods occur in the same region but at different times. Explain the reason. Fourth question, write a short note on man induced hazards briefly. B bit discuss in detail the endogenous hazards. Fifth question, A bit in what zones earthquakes occur in India. Explain the reason why it occurs in those zones. So next, what are the pre-disaster measures are taken to prevent loss of life due to the earthquakes? Sixth question, a bit, list the various, list the various types of hazards associated with earthquakes and discuss their impacts. B bit, uh, you can see, identify and discuss the various hazards which are associated with the uh, volcanic eruptions, okay? Right. We will continue. Seventh one. See here seventh question. List and uh, prioritize the mitigation tools for reducing the risk associated with floods. B bit discuss the proposed plan of linking the rivers in the context of its usefulness to combat the flood menace in India. So last uh, you can see here eighth question. What is disaster preparedness plan and its various aspects? B bit discuss the mitigation strategies with reference to specific disasters. Okay. See friends, uh, once you observe carefully these important questions, you can see not even a uh, single question is asked for full 15 marks. So this disaster management, even though it is a theory paper, so you are not asked for full 15 marks question. So each and every questions, two sub questions are given. So for that uh, one is if one is for seven marks, another will another question will be for eight marks obviously. So entire questions are of A bit and B bit. Not even a single question is asked for full 15 marks. Okay. So um, this uh, even though this is a theory paper, but the way of uh, your presentation in your answer sheet should be perfectly. Okay, so the other person, the examiner should easily understand what exact what knowledge you have regarding this uh, subject. Okay, so like that uh, you have to plan writing your answers for these questions. If you are talking about the answers, how to write the answers for this question for the given subject disaster management. So always uh, instead of writing paragraphs of theory and uh, wasting your time in your examination. So it's better uh, go for some diagrams some uh, maps okay so with the help of that maps you can explain the disaster system or uh, some block diagrams in that block diagram, diagram show the classification show the hierarchy of how the stages are taking place in this disaster management okay so that's all friends for our today's class i think all of you understood today's class uh, regarding this uh, disaster management if you are having any doubts uh, please post in the comments box. I will give you a reply. If you need any additional information on that also post in the comments box. I will give you a reply. So if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel. 
like and share our channel thank you very much thank you for watching